Oof. It's begun. The time has come. Yes. Red Dead Redemption 2. It's been eight long years. Ah. Uh. I'm so excited. Ooh. Ooh. Want to see how this looks on stream? I want it to be optimal. Come on. Have mercy. Oh, we're just in the main menu and it already looks beautiful. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm getting hit in the feels right now. Oh, he's a puppers. By 1899, the age of outlaws and gunslingers was at an end. America was becoming a land of laws. Even the West had mostly been tamed. A few gangs still roamed, but they were being hunted down and destroyed. Although I'm still mad about the title, I accept it because it's beautiful. Nice aspect ratio. Oh. Oh my good grief. Love you, Dan Hauser. 
Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll Abigail Marston? Someplace. Oh, Dutch! Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Oh, shit. <laughs> if we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. Dutch Vanderland? There. Arthur! Hey, it's hey, me. Luck. I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town. Abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on. Yeah. I love these loading screens. Chapter One, Coulter. Oof. Oh, it's beautiful. I'm curious if this whole game takes place in America, or if it spreads across multiple countries like the Bring first game. Here. Well, first game. Is that Abigail Marston? Oh, it's him. Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had. Well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground in their stead. I'd do it. Mm, sure. Gladly. But we are going to ride out and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. Well, we ain't run into them yet, so they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Uh, oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Oh, looks beautiful. Man, need you strong. Okay. All right. Oh. Let's head out. Damn. Sure what we're gonna the dynamic snow. Here, we have to try. Stay close, and we'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. In two days or more like this now. 
It has to blow over soon. I'm just like blown away. I just want to look at this real quick. How far out does this zoom? Hmm. So it's got the fog of war thing just like GTA 5 does. That's cool. I feel like we're going to come back here at some point. Oh! So you can change who you play as? That's pretty cool. Presumably. I assume that's why this is here. I want to play as John Marston again, damn it. G settings. Control. Oh. Oh, this is great. I have missed this so much. It's irregular. Camera. I want to up the field of view. Yes. I'm really digging this. The game's barely started, and I'm already, like, oh, in love with it. Alright, so we got... I'm just curious because I don't think Arthur was in the first game. Hey, move up alongside me. Can't see you back there. Can't believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tail. Yeah, you're darn right. A couple more days. We'll I love my side. accent. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. We got a fire and shelter. That's a start. So, Blackwater. Do you think it was a trap in Blackwater? That many men? Oh, they knew we were coming. There was money on that boat, all right. Lots of it. Hey, I think I see something up the path. Easy. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen, found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Er. <laughs> Was. Yeah. 
And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Michael. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Michael? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came in. He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right. Oh, right John. Anymore. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Hey, Arthur, let me take the rear. You move up. Stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Oh. Okay. Let's head down there. Oh, it's so beautiful. This is like legitimately one of the best looking games I've ever played. Let's hitch up here. Let me handle this. We don't want to spook these fine people. Someone's having fun in there. Jesus Christ. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty looking degenerates. Micah, hide behind that wagon. Arthur, you take that old shed on the left and stay low, both of them. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the Arthur, we got a problem. Oh. <laughs> Look, there's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur. need some... There's a body in the wagon. I hear you. Just Gentlemen, keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, but... Now, friend, I ain't asking for much. Please. Shit! Look out! There's more to pay! Then 
seem to be going too well. Goddamn, O'Driscoll boy's here. Why? Maybe same reason as us. Micah, go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Smells like a party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. Oh, it's so good to play in first person. O'Driscoll's. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Dry, warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Big old pool of blood on the floor here. I saw. Probably the poor bastard who lived here. Micah found a dead body in the wagon outside. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. I'm going to start packing the horses. You keep looking. Meet me out here when you're done. This game is so in-depth. Interesting. Yeah, Red Rocket. Hmm. Poor bastard was married to. Beautiful. On, Boy, Come don't on. rush me. Just give me a minute. Now. Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Are you trying to get the law on us? Sorry. Micah, you search the cabin. See what we missed. Sure. Got you. 
just jumped me. Oh, did he now? Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here and where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Where's Colm O'Trisco? With the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here, near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. I don't know more than that, I swear. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what you want with him. I don't care. But bring that horse Oh, this boy's dead. How to get my hat? with us. Arthur. Yes. It's okay. We're bad men. We ain't them. It's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. Well, not quite some, not quite some misses. Oof. Scum, they beat us to it. We found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something? 
And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Bill Williamson. I want to share a room with John. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Yes, yeah, Javier, man. We're all yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. He looked for me. Thank you. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Interesting. I wonder when free roaming will be available. Yeah, I see some smoke. Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. Mm. There's some tracks leading to the river. Sorry. I wonder if water will kill me like the last game. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So you were there, Javier. <laughs> what really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Tracks go left, down here. Davy got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Damn snow's coming in hard again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. 
interesting. Cinematic. Snow here. I don't know about this, Javier. I mean, we can't follow nothing. Uh, let's push on a little bit. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. Ooh. John! Come on! Up there! Oh. It's coming from up ahead somewhere. I don't think we can go much further on the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I grabbed that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? Interesting. Watch out here. Oh, this is steep. Yeah, that we're high up here. You're telling me. I recognize that gruff voice anywhere. Careful, there's a drop here. It's slippery, be careful. Stay low under here. Okay, good now. Watch your step. It's real slippery. Stay close to the wall. Up this way. Gap here. That sounds closer now. Come on. We're coming, John! So you gotta eat and drink. John, where are you? Austin, you hear me? John! John! John, can you hear me? John! Come here! Down on the ledge! That's John! We're coming! Down here! He's down here! Over here! Oh, you beautiful bastard. That's quite a scratch you got there. 
Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. Oh. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. John, you look beautiful. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Mm. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See? I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. Uh, you alright? I don't think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out. Oh shit. You see that on the ridge? Wolves. Come here, you motherfucker, you. Spider-Man. It's just like a, a dog bite. Uh, you know a fella? Got bit by a dog. Died. Oof. An hour later. You ain't gonna die. Yeah, you're in the first game. Not yet. You die at the end of that game. Well, and. Up there! some shelter now thanks for coming for me of course that bullet in blackwater now this you had a hell of a time and arthur always says i'm lucky none of us are lucky right now you should ride in the water for a bit try to lose a scent Oof, poor horses right back to camp you know we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving, damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. Here, let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. You gonna fall off? Here, alive. You're alive. Right, here we go. 
There we go. Ay, careful, idiotas, it's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you, thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. <laughs> thank you, Arthur. Thank, thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're gonna get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks, I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization. <laughs> civilization. The west is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss, let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. We got the Nazis. It's almost World War One. That dude's fucked. We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting. Fucking here achievement! And in mine in town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. So what now, Dutch? We get strong. We get Black water. Oh. When the storm breaks, we move. Enough, I guess. You sound doubtful. Not so Blackwater's still under construction at this point. Oh, that's the ferry. Jose, I don't feel that this is honestly anything new. I hope not. We had a bit of bad luck, but then the storm covered our tracks, so now we wait a bit and we go back to Blackwater and we get our money or we get some more money. And we keep heading west. But we're heading east. For now. For now. We got this. We're safe. Stay strong, Jose. What about you, Arthur? You doubt me too? Never. Good. Because you know me, son. I'm Oof. just getting started. Once we get some money, well, they they better send some good men after us because they ain't never going to find us. But we need money. Of course, Dutch. Thank you, son, for your strength. It means a lot to me. All I want from this game is a duster. Days on the lamb, and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess, I guess folks miss them. Bill Williamson well, hasn't changed fall, much. I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> What's a party? <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! You fools punching each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. I know you hate him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, nope, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You... You always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. Heck yeah. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators. Here. Yeah, lasso! Home? always had good information come on and you think now is the right time to hit a train now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit i'm getting too old for that life mr matthews mr smith mr pearson would you please look after the place there are o'driscoll's about yeah Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. 
He said follow the main trail southwest. They're camped near some lake. Okay, let's go find these bastards before they find us and rob this score of their plan. Heck yeah. tell the only fools out here are us and them they must be this way let's go whoop some ass you good Dutch of course listen I know you don't think much of my ideas recently but this is the right move okay you know I got your back I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll wait for him and people you love will die this feud between you and him needs to be put to rest, one way or another. <laughs> it will be. Some things I can forgive, others I can't forget. What he did to Hannibal, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited Oof. soon enough. That's how this will end. Damn right, boss. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. This is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, ready Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. Let's go. There they are. That's definitely them. Home? I think so. Yeah, that's him. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. They leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get them? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. Come on, let's get down there. Get to grab that rifle from your horse. You two get up there and keep us covered. You got it, Dutch. Good. Come on, let's. 
go. We'll circle around the far side and go down that way, same as Micah and Bill. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including Comb, can wait. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as it is. Now, come on. I'm getting a lot of Jesse James vibes from Dutch. I love it. As someone, who, especially, who loved the film, The Assassination of Jesse James by the Coward Robert Ford. Birds. I'm on it, Dutch. Mm. Who took my tobacco? Take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running. Hush. Let's just get down there first. Down through these trees, quick. I'm coming. Okay, let's get in cover. I'm ready for this job to be done. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. So we got everything we need. We have to move on this right now. Okay, fine. You make the move. Damn, Bill. Ooh. Son of a bitch. Got him.
that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything you can. Let's go. Hey, this looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. <laughs> Smells good. Come on. Did we get everything? Think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they was gonna rob. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. All right. Looks like Let's Mr. Cornwall's about to get corn hold, if you know what I mean. Some starving down and outs. They can pummel us hard as they like, but we will always get back up and fight. That's who we are. Outlaws. Yeah. Outlaws. Wait until we have John, Mac, Charles, and Sean back riding with us, and I believe, I know, they will all be back. Well, you didn't get combed, but this head will hurt him a lot more than any bullet in the head. Especially when we rob this train, too. <laughs> yeah, I guess we'll see about that. Oh, indeed we will. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will. Just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen mm -hmm. again. Damn right. All right, dig in, fellas. Let's make some ground.
You're coming with me. Come on, I, I, I'm no mm -hmm. Mister. Oh, you're fine. Quit being a baby. Oh, God, no. What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't know your name? It's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy. Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please! Don't be a pussy, Kiefer. Your mouth, you little shitter. I will shut it for you. I don't want to die, mister. Oh, take it easy. You're going to break my ribs. Have a heart, mister. Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay, okay. That's two bones right there. Shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Huh. You found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. You want me to make him talk? Oh, no. Now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting. Save fellas as need saving. And feed them as need feeding. We are going to find out what you need. I can't believe it! An O'Driscoll in my camp! No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister! I, I hate that fella! Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Colm. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now, I gotta figure out if we can hit that train. Yeah. Okay.
Jesus. That's that's a lot of shit. As far as introduction. <coughs> We're gonna starve to death up here, Mr. Morgan. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to Oof. in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea. <coughs> 50 days and you unfortunately survived when we ran away from Blackwater I wasn't able to get supplies in well when government agents are hunting you down sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short we'll survive we always have and if need Oof. be we can eat you you're the fattest I sent Lenny and Bill hunting and they found nothing well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted off. Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look at this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. Let's go hunting, boys. <coughs> Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn. Oof. Shots fired. All right. Let's head out. Ha. How are you holding up, Charles? I'm okay. Apart from this hand. Stupid mistake. Still bad? It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. I uh, sure hope I can. Never really got the hang of it. You'll be fine. <sighs> so, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill that ain't no Driscoll? Huh. There's meat up here for sure. Pearson doesn't know what he's talking about. Now the weather's eased off a bit, they'll be needing to feed. I'm freaking adoring this we'll game right this now. Way. Find some higher ground. Oh, we're going to the high ground. Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, going out for John, that thing with the old Driscolls. You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that. Just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Well, Javier told me a bit, but it sure weren't good. It's so peaceful. I can't wait to see what else this game has to offer other than this specific snowy area.
Stop here a second. I see something. There's deer been here. And recently. How can you tell? I think so. Maybe not. Focus. It's easier in the snow, but once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track nearly as well in grass and woods. There they are. Are you ready with that bow? Aim for their head or neck. We want a good, clean kill. You can pull back quite hard. You feel when it's too much. Take the shot. Oof. Need to take a second. God damn it.
my arrow I'll get the other. You sure your hands are okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay. I'll go grab the other one. Oh, he's a thick boy. <laughs> Nainers. Come on, buddy. Hey, buddy. Gonna put this dead animal on you. Hope that's okay with you. Yeah. You found him. <laughs> I knew you'd be okay. Hey, Nambo. It's easier it. when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> We've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking a couple of days back, well, maybe our luck is finally on the turn. Well, I'm sorry. I just started playing this like an hour ago. Soon. People are still weak. And you've seen how snowed in those wagons are. They ain't going nowhere until we get some more thaw. Mm, you're probably right. And even if we do get off here, it is. We still have a big price on our it looks beautiful. The yeah, gameplay is good. awesome. We'll find somewhere to lie low. Calling it game of the year. John Marston is back and he's beautiful. How Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater. We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding the old Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl. She has a wild looking... Well, her husband is dead, oh, so... Of course. She lost her husband, her home. Yeah, Everything that is probably had. true. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll for us. <laughs> well, I know who my money's on in that fight. He's weak, but that makes him much more useful. Maybe we can get to them before they get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? 
I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Nah. Uh, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang. Nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Combe, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A Don't get mad at me. I'm just riding. Oh, is that a bear? Watch out. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. Well, he's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. Fuck that shit. You must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Oh, I'm gonna kill this motherfucker. That's a bad idea. Have you seen the size of it? Cut up here, off the trail. It's too spoopy. We ain't ever talked that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might have moved on by now. You want me to move on? No. No, not at all. I just I know you could run it alone. No problem. Just because he's black doesn't mean he's independent. Time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's going to kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know... Dutch is different. Oh, yes. Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most of you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normal. Oh, he's a care. black engine. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh. 20 years, something like that. Since I was a boy. Twenty years? Yeah. He taught me to read. John, too. He taught me a few other things, him and Hosea. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. I can't wait to I see more of the environments this game has to offer. This. He always sees us right. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take oh. time the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard on the horses as on the rest of us. I don't know what Dutch would do if something happened to the Count. Same with Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. Uh, careful. I tried to ride the cow. Oof. Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. It's fucking amazing, dude. Like, the snow effects alone I'm gonna hit are like. Showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. Well, well, well. 
What a surprise. Find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my Oof. utmost to avoid. Why, he loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. I forget how many characters from this game are in the first one. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah. Oh, seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? Let's skin this Please boy. Do it together. Go get to skin you. <coughs> you always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see get you burned. later. You skin that one if you dumped on. Oh the yeah, let's skin this boy. Well, damn. Skinning's a lot more intense than it was in the last game. <laughs> damn. Too bad, Mr. Morgan. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know, you could trade these. Yeah, Nambo, I noticed. Much any town, if you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else... No wonder Rockstar is overworked. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. <coughs> yeah, well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few At days. least it doesn't show its vagina. <coughs> and hopefully it doesn't show the balls on the men. Oh, a few days later. The sun. It's been a bad few weeks. Dutch Melting. Being Dutch, he is busy making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery. You're damn right. Hey, who the hell is Leviticus Cornwall? Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some well, respect, damn. Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here, then? I owe you. Yeah. Why pain. does he look like Norman Reedus? For the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. You want me to come? Of course I do, but... Look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Yeah. Oh, little Jack Marston. The boy wanted to see you, John. You see me now. What's left of me? What about you? Guess I was hoping to well, see Well, damn. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now. Why is Abigail such a man. bitch? Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have in Blackwater. You fancy heading back? I want to go to Blackwater. Oh. Listen, Dutch. I ain't trying to undermine you. I just, I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now. Suddenly, we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutchie. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? You know, he's a big railway magnet. Oh, sugar. sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. I'm an oil Sounds man. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch. Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to ride. Hell yeah! Okay, gentlemen, 
According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Oh, look at the balls on that horse. straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Cornwall's private car. You and me, Morgan Gray. I'm gonna kill the fuck out of Micah. Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep. Yep. Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now come on. Let's ride. Ba -da -da. Ba -da -da. Hmm. Why is Chad outside of the border? Now, I can fix that. I'm seeing green. This kid. Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. Go. Oh, I see some changing environments. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times you gonna ask the same question, Market? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with people. Have fun, Nambo. It was great having you here. When I say we go back, and that's the end of it. Money safe. You'll just have to trust me. And if the O'Driscolls are right, there'll be a stack of railroad bonds on this train. Good money once we work out how to cash them. Now, everyone, shut up and get your mind on the job at hand. Come on. What are you doing? There's a water tower. Hold up here on the ridge. Oh! I was looking to chat. Uh. Uh. That didn't happen. Is Bill there? Yeah. You want to head down? See how he's getting on? Okay. Hey there, Bill. How you getting on? Yeah, I'm okay. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. Oof. We fixing to go kaboom. Okay, this is good. All right. 
that should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. Okay, boy. This is gonna be good. Just be ready to move quick and remember the plan. All of you, no mistakes. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here any minute now. I got you. That was my hat! Let's keep you son of a bitch! Come here, you son of a bitch! Fucking Abe Lincoln looking ass! It. 
Get wrecked. Your kneecaps. Let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. Come on. Up. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys, go blow that door open. Now, it don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Here we go. Now light the fuse. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. Get on up there. Search that train. <laughs> oh, damn! It's like a palace. Now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's king. I'll give you that. Okay. Let's see if we can get this open. This will be over soon. Come on. Come on. Get in there. Take all that shit. Ah. Ah. There. See? That's how it's done. Shit. Just a pile of papers. Bond? I don't think so. Here. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. Give me those. Railroad contracts. Invoices. Blah, blah, blah. You got anything? Not really. Sugar imports from the Spanish West Indies. A lot of sugar. Some fancy new boat he's ordered from Europe. The Titanic. <laughs> I am not robbing another boat as long as I live. No, this looks like something. Ooh, a thing. Have you checked all the drawers and cabinets? It's a thing. I think I got him. Nice. Well, thank God. Come on. 
Anything? Nah, oh, damn it. The lighting in this game is like incredible. I miss my hat. I need to find a new hat. What did you find? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, uh, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them. What should I do? Here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. When you get back, we'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. Hmm. Ooh, moral choices. Okay, get on the train, quick, all of you. Any bright ideas, I kill all three. So behave. Come on. Move. We won't tell a soul, I swear. You're right, you won't. Please, no. Hmm. I wonder if I should be honorable or dishonorable throughout the rest of the game. Try. Weather seems stable. There we, we go. just robbed a Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country. Where are we gonna go? I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem as long as we keep our noses clean. Well then let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. <sighs> this is a great game, damn it. Loving the music too. Can't wait to get a copyright strike. Wonder where we're going next. I want to go back to Blackwater. sure there's no surprises we've had enough of those me with the boy just go come on kid you can buy me a whiskey, yeah, whiskey. I got some whiskey here Really, we're in the back. Mm 
Fuck me, this game looks beautiful. I'm just holding A, damn it. Okay, let's take a look. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back on, Arthur. You still strong enough to hold up a wing? Shut up. I'm just saying. Don't say less. Pick the wheel up. <laughs> Now bash that wheel. Nearly there. There. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. Oh shit. The engines. They wanted trouble. We wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell you. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left, inland. So, yes, the Indians in these parts got told a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farm heartlands the country. They lost it all. Stole them clean away from them. It was every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. In spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something that's, complicated for the best. That's the same voice actor of here. Nigel West Dickens. Hey, Damn. I just noticed that. Me. This here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just cause it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. So, what happened to your tribe? I don't even know if I have one. At least, not that I can remember. My father was a colored man. He told me he lived with our people for a while. A number of free men did, but... When we were forced to move from our lands, the three of us fled. I was too young to really remember much. My whole life I've been on the run. A couple years later, some soldiers captured my mother. Took her somewhere. We never saw her again. We drifted around. He was a very sad man and the drink well, had damn. a mean hold on him. Around 13, I just took off on my own. That was about the age we found young Arthur here. Maybe a little older. A wilder delinquent you never did see. But he learned fast. Not as fast as Marston, apparently. Wait. I don't understand. What's the problem between you two? Arthur? Uh, it's Tell a it. Long story. We still heading the right way? That depends. Are we still heading west in search of fortune and repose in virgin forests as we plan? No. Are we heading in the correct direction on our desperate escape from the law eastwards down the mountains? Oof. Yes, I believe so. You know this area? A little. I've been through a couple of times. There's a livestock town not too far from here called Valentine. Cowboys, outlaws, working girls. Our kind of place. Driscoll's? Probably them too. Pinkertons? Let's hope not. And this place we're going. Wait. What's it called again? Horseshoe Overlook. It's a good place to lie low. It'll do for now. And how low do you think Dutch is really going to lie? <laughs> it's just, you know, maybe it's me who's changed, not him. But 
We kept telling him that ferry job didn't feel right. You and me had a real lead in Blackwater that could have worked out. Maybe. It just isn't like Dutch to lose his head like that. Things go wrong sometimes. I wonder what happened. People die. It's the way it is. Always has. Been. Fuck me, this game is beautiful. Dutch. We've all been in this line of work a long time. And Fucking Brockstar. Well, you need to stop. We got it right a hell of a lot more than we got it wrong. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the well, store. damn. Yeah. You can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. I've acquired some herbs. Oh, the lighting alone. Oh, my God. Stop it, Rockstar. They've really outdone themselves. Like, I'm, this stream, I'm probably going to be doing this for the next, like, couple hours of just talking about the graphics. Ugh. Oh. So beautiful. I can't handle this game. Oh, look at the map. Damn! We've been around, boy. I can't wait to discover the entire map. There's a lot of deer in this area. It's good hunting, good eating. All I want from this game now is just a duster. There you are, brother. Head in there. Follow the track for a bit. Thanks. Hey, slow up. I'll jump on. Come on, Javier. Come on, man. Okay, let's go. Any trouble getting in here, Javier? Nope. It went well. This is a good spot. Excellent. I think this will work for us, Arthur. For now, anyway. Oh. So atmospheric. Suck it, PC people. survived for now now it is time to prosper Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater we were on to something big then Micah got you all excited about that ferry and here we are 
We have all made mistakes over the years, Hosea. Every last one of us. But I kept us together. Kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck east of the Grizzlies and out of money and a, a long way from our dream of virgin land in the west. I know, my brother. But we are Dutch is so safe. young. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. I hope so. <laughs> Would you just look around you? This world has its consolation. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Now, everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough. But we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> <laughs> it is time for everyone to earn yeah. their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Yeah. Now the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. Heck yeah. Chapter 2, Horseshoe Overlook. A couple of weeks later. Achievement! Back in the mud! I completed chapter 1! Got off the mountain. Rode east into some pretty enough country called the Heartland. Ain't been this far east in many a year. Dutch seems a little better. His eyes are sparkling once more. And I can see he's thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier. In spite of black water and that whole mess. You know. I think. Jose. I think I'm probably gonna end the stream here pretty minute. I just wanna. <laughs> Relax and play this game on my own time, you know. Let's hope so. I'll definitely stream it another time. The boys but... already in Valentine, Bill, Charles, and Javier, and Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> Yeah, I think this is a good place to stop. Lisa's stream. I'm definitely going to keep this going later. I'll stream this another time, another day, maybe tomorrow. Who knows? Arthur, my boy. My dear boy. What's going on? Nothing. Nothing at all. For the first time in weeks, nothing. We're free. We're free free to plan our own futures once more. I hope so, Dutch. You kept the faith, Arthur. You always kept it. And I 